Hello, Virgo. Welcome. This is your beginning of August to the middle of August reading for this current year. Congrats, you survived another day. Surrounded by people and things that get on your nerves. I said that to my mom the other day and she just laughed. <laughs> Hope you all are doing well. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So this is, resonates with you. Good deal. If not, don't worry about it. It's just a card game after all. Doesn't have to be real if you don't want to believe in it. Page of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Three of Swords, and the Devil. Yeah? That's how we're gonna go today, huh? Alright. Hey, baby. Um. Someone doesn't want to invest very much back in the day, but they do want to offer something now. And it's like this household just leads to heartbreak, and now someone's just acting naughty naughty, or the devil's trying to sneak in here and cause some shit to happen, right? So let's see what's popping up with y'all. Mm. Okay. So, Virgo, let's see what we got up for you. We have Strength Reverse, possibly Leo. Wants and Wishes, Queen of Cups, Reverse, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Someone who looks like they're nice, but that cup's probably full of poison, so please don't drink anything she gives you, for the love of Jesus. Um, eight of Cups in the Fears and Rejections, and the situation is the Eight of Pentacles. Self-fulfilling prophecy. Working yourself for nothing, doing the exact same shit over and over. Obstacle challenge coming against you. <clears throat> Excuse me. Obstacle and challenge coming against you is the Knight of Wands. Leo, Sag, Aries. Um, someone not willing to come in and fight in order to like end this endless cycle. The catalyst as well as will bring this thing full circle. Temperance, Reverse, Sagittarius card. Lack of patience, lack of coming together, lack of moral compass. Ooh. Beginning theme. Could be you. King of Pentacles reverse. You might feel like there's something owed to you, or you're just not putting in anything and expecting everybody to give to you instead. Because you're the king, right? Right. Let's see. Oh dear, that was too much. Too much. Let's see. This song just popped in my head for you guys. It's like, I feel like I'm just too close to love you. I don't know who sings that. But it sounds like one of those. It's like, okay, so there's a Queen of Cups right here. I don't trust her just because she's reversed and she's offering a cup to this bitch. She's just like, no! I don't want your wish fulfillment. Go away! <laughs> Just like they want to walk away, get away from this shit, like just be like, no man, I'm not even. And that's kind of creepy. Um, someone isn't willing to come in to like end this um, endless cycle of working and not getting anywhere. Like they're, 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 someone's restricting themselves from doing anything just so they can get away. It's like someone could work on something but they're refusing to. The strength card reverse restrictions could be yeah, it might be your counterpart Capricorn Taurus Virgo also has their back turned and they feel like someone owes them shit uh, for whatever reason I have no idea but she's definitely that she might be a demanding mother overbearing mother or like an unfaithful spouse someone who expects to be given more than what they should be Oh dear, and this like endless cycle right here is about Bettys. We got a red Betty, a black Betty, a red, uh, a blonde Betty, too many Bettys. Someone has way too many Bettys around, and I don't like that. All these Bettys will lead to a breakup if it keeps up, right? It just, it's a revolving door. It's a revolving door of Bettys. Nobody likes Bettys. I'm just making that clear. Well, that's not true. Some people like Bettys, but... Nobody likes any of these Bettys. 
I'm about to say, that buddy better be wearing a dress because the rest of them are. Let's see. The wants and wishes right now with this queen of um, cups, right? Like, you know, the queen of cups, she's supposed to be loving. She's supposed to be kind, but in this deck, it's like she's conniving. She's got poison in that goddamn cup. Do not drink anything that she gives you. Do not drink her Kool-Aid, right? Because she's trying to stall the end longer than what it's meant to be. And I think, Virgo, you're the one trying to get away from her even though you're afraid to. It's like you know there's poison in the damn cup. Hmm. King of Wands, or not King, Knight of Wands, Leo, Sag, Aries. Obstacle and challenge is someone not going forward to fight <clears throat> in order to end the endless revolving door of Betty's. Okay, Eight of Pentacles. Reverse. Like, it didn't work back in the day? Why would it work now? <clears throat> That's the energy I'm getting. It's like, someone feels like it didn't work back then. Why is it going to work now? I'm not going to fight for this. It's just a revolving door of Betty's. Someone had to separate because of the Betty's. Red Betty is kind of hot. Black Betty, she's all right. Bam a lamb. Um, blonde Betty, who knows? <laughs> blonde Betty is giving up her cup, though. Let's see. Eight of Cups in the fears and rejection. Someone wants to walk away and reject this Queen of Cups cup because they know it's poison. But someone is rejecting that and ignoring their intuition completely. Like, they realize that they should walk away, but they're not. They're ignoring their intuition as they walk away. It's like, they should, but they're rejecting it because they're ignoring their intuition. They should know better than to believe this Queen of Cups here. You guys have been having the Queen of Cups show up in your guys' readings a lot as a late. Like, you're dealing with a water sign, and it's like they're purposely misleading you. Temperance reverse. Moral codes are ignored. Nobody wants to be together. Nobody wants to make a community together. Everybody's separating. Um, trying to get out. Trying to escape. Don't know where they're going, but they're going somewhere. They'll get out of that cave eventually to get out of here, but they're definitely making a plan to escape. And ending theme. Strength shadow side reverse. Someone's a pussy. <laughs> Someone might be terrified, possibly of a Capricorn, since the devil's in here. Because King of Pentacles is saying, hey, I'm owed something. Hmm. And there's the Queen of Pentacles over here. <laughs> Which, mind you, her and her counterpart are not happy. Both of them feel like they're owed something or something's due. So one's just aggressive enough to say it, and the other one is. What are you doing? Sexy. Mm. Yeah, one's not even paying attention because it's just like if you don't give me what I want, like I'm just turning my back to you. And the other one's like, but this belongs to me, you know. Yeah, there's a power trip going on here between the strength with the Queen of Pentacles and the revolving door of Betty's. Someone's got too many options in this, I feel like. Someone's getting a lot of wrong advice and going to the wrong people about that shit, too. There's this Queen of Cups and shit. It's like... It's like someone's trying to convince you that they can't fight, even though that's not true. Like, she's purposely, like, poisoning the cup. Making this shit last longer than what it should, right? So be careful with the water sign. Last card. Oh, my nose. Whoever looks defeated is not defeated. They are the, the, the one who is on the ground is the actual victor. Virgo, I think there's somebody here 
who's convincing you of some shit that isn't necessarily the case. And I'm not sure what it is, but it's got something to do with the Queen of Cups right here. And it's like... I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what this is, actually. Cancer's was kind of like this, too, where it was, like, confusing at first, and then I redid theirs, and it was like I was looking at first at what was going on on the outside, but then when I did the second reading, I could see what was actually going on inside, and I was like, oh, you little sneaks, I know what you're doing now. But it's like you're dealing with somebody who's acting like they can't defend themselves, so they... So you're doing it for them? But in truth, they know how to defend themselves just fine. It's like you're playing the mind games for them. Be very careful with that. Actually, you know what? We're gonna, what's going to happen at the end? What's the result of all this? Oh, okay. Yeah, well, you know, that's how it goes. Um, the per like, It looks like this person's just going to let shit keep going until um, everything's on fire. Pretty much ruined the entire countryside acting like they were too weak. Be very careful, Virgo, because someone's definitely playing to your good nature. You know, you're the earth sign that works for others. So it's like, this person's trying to recruit your service, and it's like, you want to walk away from this situation because you know exactly where it's leading, but you're ignoring your intuition because they're too nice. Which is like, you know, I don't know, but that's on you, Virgo. Be very careful. That's the end of your reading. Thanks for watching the video, of course. You may like, share, subscribe if that's what you want to do. No pressure. If you want a personal reading, all my information, 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 because I can't talk, is in the uh, description box below as well as the playlists I use. Um, you guys have a good day and please be careful because I don't like the fact that someone's using your good nature against you to fight their battles for them by pretending that they're weaker. Because it, it, it's very obvious, especially with the Emperor right here, they're not fucking weak. Hell, they got a revolving door of Bettys. You know? So be very careful. Because your counterpart over here is restricting themselves for some reason. But I don't know why. You know? So, I'll see you guys later. Take it easy. Bye-bye.